going on guys, it's Arto Epic Gamer here and today I'm bringing you guys a, a gameplay commentary. This is a part 2 of my Marvel the Dead First Attempt series and like I said before in the previous episode, make sure you check it out if you haven't already and we do get a sad, unfortunate ending. Anyway guys, uh, so in this video I'd like to talk about, well, um, i like to talk about the new Uprising DLC. The Uprising DLC released on April the 16th on Xbox and May the 16th on PS3. And, well, I'm just going to be talking about it really. So, first of all, the Uprising DLC came with four multiplayer maps and one zombies map. The zombies map is what you're watching in the background. That's for giving me the lip. The multiplayer maps that came out were uh, Studio, which is a remake of Fire and Rage, Vertigo, Magma, and Ombre. Now, I haven't really been playing the multiplayer maps. I like Studio just because it's a remake of Fire and Range and I really like that map from Black Ops 1. And um, Magma I haven't really play, pe played at all, so I don't really know about it, but it's kind of anyway. campy uh, from watching videos and stuff. And I, I joined one game with triple cap and stuff, but everyone was head glitching, so it's pretty bad. And same with Encore, I think. I think I managed to I've played it like once, got a few sets and that's about it. And Vertigo, Vertigo I think is pretty good. Um, it. But my friend managed to get a nuclear and I died quite close to it as well on our first time playing. And my friend who got the nuclear is Operation Pwned. And yeah, it's quite a good map. I fell off the map actually on my nuclear. Getting really low on ammo! Um, yeah, but I don't really want to pick that map but it's, it's a bit disappointing. It, it, it didn't come with a multiplayer gun or score streak or anything. And so if, you, if you're like a multiplayer guy, then I, I think Revolution would better to get because it came with peacekeeper and the maps are just a bit better if you really like hey, like, you fucking range, single bullet. now uprising first of all if you play a lot of zombies i really advise you get it because mock of the dead is probably the best map that doesn't the sound studio. good um, it has like uh, so much new stuff it has the new afterlife mode new perks new stuff it's just got so much um the golden spork the hell's retriever hell's everything I'm so much of this is really good. Awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can try all you want. Um, it won't change nothing! That's quite good. Uh, like I said, there's a zombie's boss, Brutus, and he's pretty cool as well. Uh, kind of annoying when you've got the box. And. Everything Straight up scattergun. But I think it now should only cost. My when, when something is locked, it should only cost half of the price. Or what it, what it, whatever he locks, to so say he locks Juggernaud, it should cost like what did I do wrong? electric cherry, one k nothing to shit, etc. I think there should be a few more box locations in the map as well. I think there's many, but I do like the, fire, the variety of weapons in the box. I also like the, the new uh, the weapons and stuff like uh, the blunder guy, I like the pad brush, I like the acid guy. The one thing I just have to say is uh, the zombie shield is a bit overpowered, it's like 40 hits to break it, which is a little bit disappointing, well not disappointing, it's a little bit overpowered, it's just too easy, it makes them up a bit too easy, but it's still, if it was like lowered down to 30, but I don't want it to be as deep as tragic. anyway, so the zombie shield is just a bit, I, uh, like, off, one more pot, so. out of here. um, yeah, I, I guess that's, no, I, I'd also like to talk about the the box locations. Like I was saying, um, they, there's not really enough box locations. I think there should have been one, um, one on the Golden Gate Bridge, and maybe one. Don't touch me, you fucking goofy-looking bastard. One in the uh, starting room area as well, because I don't just think it's a bit too hard, especially once you get a fire cell and stuff. And Let's yeah, that's really all I want to talk about, guys. So if you really like zombies, I really advise you get this DLC. And yeah, that's it, guys. Oh, Please. oh yeah, make sure you like the favorite. Yeah, I'm only finishing the first what part. you started. Make sure you check out the next part when it's uploaded. I'll do another commentary subject. And that's it, guys. So make sure you subscribe too. Peace.
burning powder over here. I think there's a way around me. They're fucking wrong. I can't shoot without slugs! Good. 